Okay. Let me explain to you if I can work under pressure and how I can handle it. So working under pressure can be challenging. So we need to accept this. I have experienced so many times working under pressure in my career. Of course, handling work under pressure requires a combination of skills and strategies. So I also can tackle those kinds of challenges and work under pressure by utilizing several strategies to manage my time, stress and perform effectively in high pressure situations. So the first thing I am trying to do is most of the time I try to prioritize my tasks. So I make a list of tasks that need to be done and prioritize them based on importance and urgency. This helps me stay focused and avoid getting overwhelmed. And another thing I'm trying to do is I take breaks. Regular breaks help me stay fresh and avoid burnout. For example, sometimes I take a few minutes to stretch. I go for a walk if I have time, of course. And I get some fresh air or do something complete, completely different to clear my mind. I also eliminate distractions in my working environment. So I turn off notifications on my mobile phone, close unnecessary tabs on my computer, and I create a quiet workspace to minimize distractions. And this helps me, believe me, this helps me concentrate on my job efficiently. And <clears throat> I always, another thing I'm trying to do is under pressure, I always try to stay organized. So I keep my workspace and schedule organized to minimize stress and confusion. Because of this reason, I use tools like calendars, to-do lists, and I use a schedule and planner. I mean, I use reminders to keep track of my tasks and deadlines. So I use a schedule and a planner. This is very important. So I create a schedule that includes specific blocks of time for each task of mine and stick to it as much as possible. This also helps me a lot avoid distractions, stay organized and focused. And another thing is that most of the time I stay, I try to stay positive in my working environment. I try to maintain a positive attitude and focus on what I can control. I try to avoid negative self-talk and instead focus on solutions and progress. So I reframe challenges as opportunities and maintain a sense of humor. And another important thing is, of course, learning to say no, to, to say no when needed. So to be able to say no when needed is very important. So it, it is helping me a lot uh, in managing my time efficiently and working uh, productively in working working in that environment under pressure so i don't take on more than i can handle it's okay to turn down tasks or responsibilities that are not critical urgent or that can be delegated to someone else <clears throat> and uh, another thing i am trying to do is <clears throat> I try to manage my stress. I am pretty good at finding healthy ways to manage stress, such as exercise or deep breathing exercises. Another thing is I try to seek support in case I need it. And I like actually communicating with the people in my working place. So I never hesitate to ask for any help or delegate my tasks to my colleagues in my working environment. So building a support network helps me manage pressure and maintain a healthy work-life balance. So my good communication with my colleagues helps ease the pressure and ensure everyone is on the same page. <clears throat> and the next one that I am trying to do is I set realistic expectations and achievable 
achievable goals. So I break down large tasks into smaller pieces, more manageable goals. This makes it this makes it easier to track my progress and stay uh, motivated. Moreover, I try to make sure that I am not taking on more than I can handle and set achievable goals for myself. Additionally, <clears throat> I can say that uh, uh, I track my time, so I keep a log of how much time I spend on each task and identify the areas where I can improve myself. So this helps me make better use of my time in the future. And another thing is I try to stay flexible. This is very important. I never get afraid to make changes to my schedule if necessary, if I need it. So sometimes unexpected events can occur that require me to rearrange my schedule. So I want to say that I always keep in mind that it's okay to feel pressure in working environment. Also, I have, as I said, I have experienced so many times. I mean, uh, I felt pressure in my working in my environment, but it is important to manage it in a healthy and productive way. So by following these kinds of strategies of mine, yes, I can work effectively under pressure and can manage my productivity and well-being. Thank you so much.